The Olympic meant to showcase the world's best athletes. So why would France use such a massive platform to mock the Last Supper? This version of the ceremony is being criticized as the worst in the history of the Games. The ceremony which took place on Friday has sparked controversy among church leaders and conservative politicians for its perceived resemblance to Leonardo da Vinci's depiction of the Last Supper. Some critics have labeled it a mockery of Christianity. The event's planners and organizers have denied denied that the sequence was inspired by the Last Supper or intended to mock or offend. In the performance broadcast during the ceremony, a woman wearing a silver halo-like headdress stood at the center of a long table, with drag queens posing on either side of her. Later, a giant cloche lifted to reveal a man, nearly naked and painted blue, on a dinner plate surrounded by fruit. He broke into song as the drag queens danced behind him. The tableau drew condemnation from those who saw the images as a parody of the the Last Supper, the New Testament scene famously depicted by Da Vinci. The French Bishops' Conference, representing the country's Catholic bishops, issued a statement saying the opening ceremony included scenes of mockery and derision of Christianity. Influential American Catholic Bishop Robert Barron of Minnesota called it a gross mockery. For those saying it's not the Last Supper, come on. This person is literally emerging from a dinner tray. And if you zoom out, everyone's positioned exactly like in the famous Last Supper painting. To me and many others, it looks pretty similar. In response to the controversy, Mississippi-based telecommunications provider C Spire announced it would pull its advertisements from Olympics broadcast. Speaker Mike Johnson described the scene as shocking and insulting to Christian people. Many people around the world were upset with this show. Thomas Jolly, the artistic director of the opening ceremony, stated at a news conference that the event was not meant to be subversive or shocking people or mock people. Andis Camps, the Paris 2024 spokeswoman, also expressed regret, saying, if people have taken any offense, we are, of course, really, really sorry. Then Thomas Jolly emphasized that he had not been inspired by the Last Supper. It is Dionysus who arrives at the table, he said in a television interview with the French media. Dionysus is the Greek god of festivities and wine, and is the father of Sequana, the goddess of the Seine River, he said. The idea was instead to have a grand and pagan festival connected to the gods of Olympus. What do you think about this?